These tools allow us to export selected schedules to Excel, perform edit sessions in Excel, and then re-import the tables back into Revit. In this dialog box, I will select the tables I want to export, because I have more options, whether to single files or to separate files. So I click on export and enter some name for this schedule. For example, a room schedule for third floor. The resulting output format is XLSX, so I can directly open it in a well-known Excel environment. The green colored parameters in the table we can see here can be edited. So I will perform some change in Excel. You can of course use expressions or use another way to fill the cells. Of course you can modify just the green cells, which is logical. You cannot, for example, change room area or volume. Revit wouldn't know how to change it, whether it should move walls or what. Next I will save the file and select it in this import dialog box. After confirming, the file is imported back into Revit and the Excel sheet cells are read into the Revit table updating its cells. In Revit it behaves like I modified it directly in the parameter here in this library element. So data modified in Excel can be imported in Revit.